Alrighty guys, now we've entered noggin time from our lesson, and what we're going to do is we're going to illustrate the following fractions, okay? Now feel free to illustrate the fractions however you'd like as long as they're in equal parts. So we're going to start with two thirds, and we're going to make our hole, which is going to be the, third, the, the hole here, and we're going to divide it or cut it into three equal parts, two, three, and what we're going to do is take two of those parts to make our fraction. So we're going to take one, two. We have two out of the three, two thirds. The next one is two fourths. So here we're going to make our hole and we're going to cut it into four parts. Okay? Our numerator is two, so we're going to take two of those parts to equal our fraction. One, two. Two out of the four. Two fourths. For this fraction here, we have three eighths. So we're going to take our whole and we're going to cut it into eight parts. Okay. We have our eight parts here, and we're going to take three of those parts to make our fraction. So we're going to take one, two, three. We have three eighths. Our last fraction here is 9 tenths, so we're going to take our whole and we're going to cut that into 10 parts. Okay, 10 parts, and we need 9 of these parts to complete our fraction. So we're going to take 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, Seven, eight, nine. Nine out of the ten, nine, uh, nine tenths. So on your paper, you should have something similar to these illustrations to illustrate our fraction. So we have two thirds, two fourths, three eighths, and nine tenths. So take a look at your paper and it should resemble this. All right, so thank you very much, guys.